Okay, hello. Um, I choose to do my presentation on my favorite, favorite book, The Undefeated by Kwame Alexander and Kadar, Kadir Nelson. And just to give you a background knowledge of this book, um, this book talks about young African-American people, old African-American people, basically represents the African-American community and all they were able to get through in such a hard time. I think it should be a classic or will be a classic in the future for children because it talks about people of the people who have color and has done something amazing in history as an African-American person. I think it is important for children to read this book to get a sense of knowledge of what African-Americans went through and what they accomplished. And yeah, I just think it sheds light on African-American people. It is perfect for the timing now because we have been going through a lot of Black Lives Matter um, protests. And I think it's super important that to show that no matter your skin color, no matter who you are, everyone's important, everyone's human, everyone deserves the same amount of rights. Yeah. So I'm just gonna read a little bit about the book to just show what it highlights of the African-American community. So The Undefeated by Alexander, by Kwame Alexander, illustrated by Kadir Nelson. I also love this book because the pictures also show African-American people throughout history that have done some type of change in the world. This is the unforgettable, the swift and the sweet ones who hurdled history and opened a world of possible. I think this alone says a lot because if you know history, a lot of African Americans were not able to do the things that white people or other races could do. So just being able to do things that they were told they were unable to do is super important. The Ones Who Survived America By Any Means. A lot of people died through slavery and a lot of people had to fight through that. And the ones who didn't. So they talk about the people who survived through it and the people who didn't survive. This is for the undeniable, the ones who scored with chains on one hand and faith in the other. This is for the unfallible, the sophisticated ones, the box adversity and the tackle versions. Who shine their light in the world to see and don't stop till the break of dawn. This is for the unafraid, the audacious one, the one who carried a red flag and the weary blues on the battlefield to the save and perfect union. The righteous ones marching who sang, we shall not be moved because black lives matter. All right, so I'm just going to stop there. I could continue reading on and on, but it basically highlights the people who made a change in history, what they had to go through. And I do think it should be a classic. And I do think in the future, it will be a classic. More children should read this book and it speaks a high volume of people, not only for African-American people, but a lot of other people. Overall, I just love this book. It's a great book. It's beneficial to all types of children. Um, and I do think it will speak to future children because it represents our history. It shows what African-Americans had to go to or will go through. And it should be a classic or a potential classic. It speaks to more than just the African-American people. It also shows great illustrations of people of history. So yeah.
This is The Undefeated by Kwame Alexander.